Hello, my beautiful Pisces. Welcome to your horoscope forecast. And this is going to be where, um, how does your love interest feel about you right now? That's going to be what we're going to talk about. However, we're going to first talk about um, where do they stand with you romantically in the current? What's their feelings for you? And then we're going to find out what they want to say to you and some advice. And if you guys like it this way, you want me to continue this way, hit that like button. Let me know in the comments below. You do both. Let's jump right in. All right, so where is Pisces love interest when it comes to them and the current romantically? What's going on from Pisces love interest perspective? Show me the cards I need to see. Show me the cards I need to see. Okay, so we got this situation where they're trying to regain some kind of confidence here with the strength card energy to bring something into balance. So there's something triggering to their ego that they're not telling you about. Hmm. Let's get more information here, Pisces. What's going on with my Pisces love interest, the one they're here for, the one they want about? How is Pisces love interest seeing Pisces in the current romantically? Show my cards you see. Show me the cards you need to see. Yeah, something around this house or home situation. Something has changed. Hmm. Let's see the Kipper. Let's see what the Kipper has to say. Um, how's Pisces love interest seeing Pisces romantically in the current? Show me cards you need to see. Show me the cards I need to see. Okay, let's see. There's a definitely a, an energy of like sorrow, sadness, and regrets about this money situation. Your focus right now is to look to the past and to stay hopeful. Don't lose hope. Ending stop, take a break. In the past, there was definitely some confusions here. Somebody felt like they were wearing rosy colored glasses. They weren't seeing things clearly. And there was this concern about being used because of this house and home situation. Hmm. Okay, let's see the obstacle or blockage. Overthinking. Not sure about the long-term plans. Complacent, stuck in the middle. With a legal situation. That is the obstacle or blockage here. What's your advice? Your advice is you're going to have a victory, okay? You're very attractive. Realize your value and your worth. Stand your ground. Stand your ground. Okay, the influence is actually someone who is reacting. So the Knight of Swords, just let me give you an example of what I mean by reacting. Okay, so you know if somebody says something offensive to you. And then you just say something and like you get upset and you're just like react to it. That's the Knight of Swords, okay? Something happened in the influence where someone reacted. And now it's like my hands are tied. I feel like I'm trapped in the situation. I'm going around in circles. And it's causing a lot of worries and self-doubt. Okay, this is the current. This house and home situation, lots of anxiety and grief about this money situation. And an ending of this legal situation where restrictions and boundaries is causing a lot of worries and concerns. Okay, moving this out of the way. I feel used in this house situation. I want something to change. I'm hopeful, but I'm stuck in the middle. I find you very attractive, but I keep going around in circles. There was uh, some sly, slick, deceptive energy to regain confidence. Yeah, somebody wasn't being honest about something from before in their plans. We see a victory, attention, and somebody who was reactive to it. Okay. Let's find out how your love interest feels about you, Pisces. How does Pisces love interest, the one they're here for, the one they want to know about, how does Pisces love interest feel about Pisces romantically? Show me cards you need to see. Show me the cards I need to see. All right, we're going to use a couple different decks here, so let's do that. 
How does Pisces love it? The one they're here for, the one they want about. How does Pisces love it? Just feel how Pisces romantically. Show my cards you need to see. Show me the cards I need to see. All right, let's use the Kipper. How does Pisces love interest? The one they're here for, the one they want to know about. How does Pisces love interest? Feel about Pisces romantically. Show my cards you see. Show me the cards I need to see. Okay. So your person wants to, they're frustrated and defensive about getting hurt. They're in a state of confusion. They feel stuck in the middle because of this infringing party or self-doubt around this travel situation or moving. I can't stop thinking about you, Pisces. I feel like there's been distance, far away energy or travel here from this house and home situation. I want to take actions of love towards you, but I feel really defeated that I want at what cost. I really need to defend my position when it comes to these other people when it comes to you. You are my person. I needed some help with this house situation. There was this work and this person gave me good advice and now I'm in the state of regret. I followed this advice, sister, daughter, friend, karmic, and I really wanted to put my boundaries up and I wanted to be more organized. I wanted more uh, control. And I lost the money there, five of pentacles energy. Or there was a sense of loss here. We see mother, older sister, aunt. I was concerned about this loss. I find you very attractive. I feel trapped in my thoughts. We see sister, daughter, friend, karmic. Okay, we're just gonna go a little further on this Pisces. How does Pisces love interest? The one they're here for, the one they want to know about. How does Pisces love interest feel about Pisces romantically? Show my cards you need to see. Show my cards you need to see. I was shocked, Pisces, by these actions and these changes. You really amazed me. I felt like there was a miracle in our connection and a lot of success. I needed some time to think about things and I saw great changes in our connection and I really want you. You really fulfill my desires. Okay, so there was a shock. They were amazed about this soul searching. They took actions. They saw miracles here and they wanted some positive changes. There were some things that they had to work on to fix the situation for their success to get the, what they want. Their thoughts of this work situation and restrictions and this distance far away energy, they took someone's advice and there was uh, concerns about losing out on this house situation. And that would cause them a lot of regrets and sorrow here with this sister, daughter, friend, or karmic. I was stuck in the middle, Pisces, when it comes to sister, daughter, friend. There was a lot of self-doubt and I felt used by this mother, older sister, aunt. I wanted to travel to this house and I felt like my hands were tied. This is very specific messages, that's for sure. Uh, there was fighting and arguing about this romance and this advice that was given. I was uh, caught, I, I, I hear, caught in the middle. Um, I was feeling like I was gonna get hurt because I won at what cost and there was a loss of this confusion. I wanna defend my position because I find you very attractive. Or I wanted to defend my position when it came to this feminine energy or, or mother or older sister. Okay, um, let me get you guys some advice. So it looks like they had to, and let's just talk about the feelings. They have feelings for you, they find you very attractive, but it's like there's people around the situation in a very complex situation with a house. And it's like they're kind of stuck in the middle or caught in the middle of this. And it's like they have to keep defending this and arguing about this connection with the other people around them. Okay, yes, so let's find out what they wanna to say to you. What is Pisces love interest? The one they're here for, the one they want to know about. What does Pisces love interest want to say to Pisces romantically? Show me the cards I need to see. Show me the cards I need to see. Okay, so I disappeared. You're my favorite. I was playing games. You're mine. I wasn't 
I was acting like I didn't care. I fantasize about you. It's on. I see you looking good and moving on, and I don't care who's talking to you. Um, I will compete for you. I want a future with us, your perfection. Is it true or are you dating someone else? There was this, I needed to take a leadership role to heal this situation, so that's why I ran away. Emotional intimacy with you, you're so special. Unblock me. I'm obsessed with the wild side here. This isn't a goodbye. I'm leaving this situation, I was gaslighting you, and I am hurt and crying over it when it came to giving attention to others. When it comes to this isolation or separation or loneliness, I dream about you. Are you still listening to me, Pisces? I wanna let go of this past because no one compares to you. You're very smart. It's simple. How I feel about us, I want us forever. I want you to have my children. So the Empress can be fertility, pregnancy, or motherly energy, or like maybe you, they have a child or you have a child. They feel like they, they, there's like this energy of blending families together or even having children or starting a family. They feel like there's a sense of loss because it wasn't the right time and they listen to other people's opinions. That's the bottom line here. They listen to other people's opinions. So it's it definitely they're digging you, but it's just that they were listening to other people's opinions which caused issues in this connection. All right, so what action should Pisces take towards their love interest for the highest best good for the best possible offer for them? What should they do at this time for the best possible offer for them? Show my cards I need to see. Show me the cards I need to see. Okay, what should you do, Pisces? Okay, don't feel bad about this situation, okay? The clutter has to be cleared out. Things have to be purified first. And you need to have a backup plan and a strategy. Focus on your priorities at this time. Slow down and take a pause and look beyond immediate appearances. Because obviously, because of the situation that's going on with this person, it seems like there's a lot of stuff that you're not seeing about this situation but beneath the surface, right? So you gotta look beyond immediate appearances here. And it's saying you have to honor your soul's purpose. You have all the resources that you need. You already have the foresight of knowing what's gonna happen here. Pisces, what do I always say about you guys? You guys are very intuitive, right? Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, very intuitive signs. So you guys probably already had the vision about some things that are gonna happen around the situation. It's saying that you have choices here. However, with your situation, prepare for major changes and trust your higher self on this. All right, my beautiful Pisces, I love you guys so much. If you guys like it this way, you want me to continue this way, hit that like button. Let me know in the comments below. So basically with your person, there's nothing you can do at this time. It is on their end. They're gonna to have to handle that. But for now, focus on your spiritual purpose, your spiritual reason why you're here. And when the changes happen, that's when you'll have some choices that you can make, okay? But obviously you can't do anything about this situation. They have to change what's going on there with that. All right, my beautiful darlings, I love you guys so much. I'll see you guys another day or two. Also, the another JWZ episode's going up on Sunday, so stay tuned for that. So if you're a fan of uh, hauntings, true crime stories, um, mysteries, then Sunday, mystery Sundays are for you. So I'm gonna be posting every other Sunday. Maybe I'm gonna start posting every Sunday for mysteries, JWZ mystery Sundays. So stay tuned for that. It'll be posted Sunday Eastern Standard Time because I know we're all in different time zones, but it'll be Eastern Standard Time Sunday. All right, my beautiful darlings, I love you guys so much. If you guys like it this way, you want me to continue this way, hit that like button. Let me know in the comments below. I'll see you guys another day or two. Have a great rest of your next couple days, and I will see you guys soon.